Did you see this? This is crazy. Uh, when you see this, um, when you pop the question to that someone special, you want to make sure that it's a moment you will both rem remember forever. But not all memories are good memories. This morning, one man is going viral for possibly the worst wedding proposal of all time. Here it is. This Russian man decided staging an abduction was the best way to surprise his girlfriend and pop the question. And for some reason, once she was done crying, she did say yes. No, thank you. I would be laying oh, haymakers no. on that guy. Yeah. Left and right, uppercuts. This wedding. Oh, come will, on. She said yes, probably out of fear. This Doomed. wedding will not happen. No, I mean. If you go back and actually horrific. watch the video, from the vantage, because they have more than one vantage point. I saw from when they jump out of the truck and you hear her screams and she is absolutely terrified. They get the other, the, the driver out of the car and you just hear her literally shrieking, praying, crying. It is a hard watch and I'm still having a hard time watching this poor girl. I would be terrified to spend the rest of my life with this man if he thought that was funny. You cannot just put a romantic track underneath this video and At call all. it a romantic <laughs> video. They smashed the windows yes. of the car. Oh my goodness. You have to imagine, these two have been in a relationship for a while. She probably confessed at some point that a big fear of her is perhaps being abducted. Yes. And then he does th that. Yeah, I mean, that's just, uh, you know, I, I, I think when we all agree with each other, it's uh, not very uh, entertaining, but yes. nonetheless, I don't know another way to look at it. Yeah. Like, there's only one way to look at that video, and that's crazy, right? Like, for our, our friendship anniversary, <laughs> I'd trap us in an elevator. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, right? I, first of all, I would never get in an elevator with you because <laughs> you cannot, you can't, like, I know you and I know me. You can't have two people that would freak out. Yes. Mm. Well, you, but it, but it, and you would, can't it wouldn't just be the two of us. So it would be me, you, Derek, and yeah, Dina. Yeah, but. In that case, you would want mm. to say we should break it up, but you probably wouldn't. No. And we would both be in the elevator. We'd have to go. We'd, freaking out. Yeah, there's too many people for in an yeah, elevator. I, I don't disagree. <laughs> you gotta go. What? Well, you know. Maybe I'll go with Derek, and you go with Dina or no, something. No, I'm definitely the going with The two of Derek. you would accidentally <laughs> manifest an elevator emergency. Yes. That's the problem. Yeah. Because you'd both be thinking yeah. about it. So. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no problem here. It's just a big elevator. You just fear. made me hyperventilate. <laughs> but that is the equivalent of what this man did, and then said, "Will you marry me to this poor lady?" I mean, that's a hard no for me. I would yeah. never do. That. Or you're showing your parents this video. Can you imagine? And they're like, Ugh. what? Right. You're going to marry that guy? <laughs> and I do think there's a part of a society that we live in, though, too, where no matter what you do, whether it's a proposal, uh, a ba gender reveal for a baby or yeah. something like that, uh, an Instagrammable moment, a yeah. picture where you're falling off a cliff dying, we go through these extreme lengths to get the most amount of views and likes possible. And that, that just, so many times it misses the mark. I think that absolutely missed, missed the mark. Missed it for me. Whew.